Methionine, Wikipedia article audio. Methionine is an essential amino acid in humans. Methionine is important in angiogenesis, the growth of new blood vessels, and supplementation may benefit those suffering from copper poisoning. Biomedical details A proteinogenic amino acid Encoding Derivatives S-adenosylmethionine Biosynthesis Transsulfurylation pathway Other biochemical pathways Catabolism Regeneration Reverse transsulfurylation pathway, conversion to cysteine Ethylene synthesis Chemical synthesis Human nutrition Requirements Dietary sources Restriction Health Other uses Overconsumption of methionine, the methyl group donor in DNA methylation, is related to cancer growth in a number of studies. Methionine was first isolated in 1921 by John Howard Mueller. Methionine is an alpha amino acid that is used in the biosynthesis of proteins. It contains an alpha amino group, an alpha carboxylic acid group, and an S methylthioether side chain, classifying it as a nonpolar, aliphatic amino acid. Methionine is coded for by the initiation codon meaning it indicates the start of the coding region and is the first amino acid produced in a nascent polypeptide during mRNA translation. Together with cysteine, methionine is one of two sulfur-containing proteinogenic amino acids. Excluding the few exceptions where methionine may act as a redox sensor, methionine residues do not have a catalytic role. This is in contrast to cysteine residues, where the thiol group has a catalytic role in many proteins. The thioether does however have a minor structural role due to the stability effect of S-pi interactions between the side chain sulfur atom and aromatic amino acids in one third of all known protein structures. This lack of a strong role is reflected in experiments where little effect is seen in proteins where methionine is replaced by norleucine, a straight hydrocarbon side chain amino acid which lacks the thioether. It has been conjectured that norleucine was present in early versions of the genetic code, but methionine intruded into the final version of the genetic code due to the fact it is used in the cofactor S adenosyl methionine. This situation is not unique and may have occurred with ornithine and arginine. Methionine is one of only two amino acids encoded by a single codon in the standard genetic code. In reflection to the evolutionary origin of its codon, the other on codons encode isoleucine, which is also a hydrophobic amino acid. In the mitochondrial genome of several organisms, including metazoa and yeast, the codon AUA also encodes for methionine. In the standard genetic code AUA codes for isoleucine and the respective tRNA uses the unusual base lysidine or agmatine to discriminate against AUG. The methionine codon AUG is also the most common start codon. A start codon is message for a ribosome that signals the initiation of protein translation from mRNA when the AUG codon is in a COSAC consensus sequence. As a consequence, methionine is often incorporated into the N-terminal position of proteins in eukaryotes and archaea during translation, although it can be removed by post-translational modification. In bacteria, the derivative N-formyl methionine is used as the initial amino acid. The methionine derivative S-adenosyl methionine is a cofactor that serves mainly as a methyl donor. 
SAM is composed of an adenosyl molecule attached to the sulfur of methionine, therefore making it a sulfonium cation. The sulfur acts as a soft Lewis acid which allows the S-methyl group to be transferred to an oxygen, nitrogen, or aromatic system, often with the aid of other cofactors such as cobalamin. Some enzymes use SAM to initiate a radical reaction, these are called radical SAM enzymes. As a result of the transfer of the methyl group, S-adenosyl homocysteine is obtained. In bacteria, this is either regenerated by methylation or is salvaged by removing the adenine and the homocysteine, leaving the compound dihydroxypentandine to spontaneously convert into autoinducer 2, which is excreted as a waste product slash quorum signal. As an essential amino acid, methionine is not synthesized de novo in humans and other animals who must ingest methionine or methionine-containing proteins. In plants and microorganisms, methionine biosynthesis belongs to the aspartate family, along with threonine and lysine. The main backbone is derived from aspartic acid, while the sulfur may come from cysteine, methane thiol, or hydrogen sulfide. The pathway utilizing cysteine is called the transsulfuration pathway, while the pathway utilizing hydrogen sulfide is called direct sulfurylation pathway. Cysteine is similarly produced, namely it can be made from an activated serine and either from homocysteine or from hydrogen sulfide, the activated serine is generally O-acetylserine but an aripyrum pernix and some other archaea o phosphoserine is used. Cis k and cis m are homologs, but belong to the PLP fold type 3 clade. Enzymes involved in the E. coli transsulfurylation route of methionine biosynthesis. Although mammals cannot synthesize methionine, they can still use it in a variety of biochemical pathways. Methionine is converted to S-adenosylmethionine by methionine adenosyl transferase. SAM serves as a methyl donor in many methyl transferase reactions, and is converted to S-adenosylomocysteine. Adenosylomocysteinase converts SAH to homocysteine. There are two fates of homocysteine, it can be used to regenerate methionine or to form cysteine. Methionine can be regenerated from homocysteine via methionine synthase in a reaction that requires vitamin B12 as a cofactor. Homocysteine can also be remetylated using glycine betaine to methionine via the enzyme betaine homocysteine methyltransferase. BHMT makes up to 1.5% of all the soluble protein of the liver and recent evidence suggests that it may have a greater influence on methionine and homocysteine homeostasis than methionine synthase. Homocysteine can be converted to cysteine. This amino acid is also used by plants for synthesis of ethylene. The process is known as the Yang cycle or the methionine cycle. Racemic methionine can be synthesized from diethyl sodium thalimidomalonate by alkylation with chloroethyl methyl sulfide followed by hydrolysis and decarboxylation. The Food and Nutrition Board of the U.S. Institute of Medicine set recommended dietary allowances for essential amino acids in 2002. For methionine combined with cysteine, for adults 19 years and older, 19 mg slash kg body weight slash day. High levels of methionine can be found in eggs, sesame seeds, Brazil nuts, fish, meats and some other plant seeds. Methionine is also found in cereal grains. Most fruits and vegetables contain very little of it. Most legumes are also low in methionine. However, it is the combination of methionine and lysine which is considered for completeness of a protein. 
Racemic methionine is sometimes added as an ingredient to pet foods. There is scientific evidence that restricting methionine consumption can increase lifespans in fruit flies. A 2005 study showed methionine restriction without energy restriction extends mouse lifespan. A study published in Nature showed adding just the essential amino acid methionine to the diet of fruit flies under dietary restriction, including restriction of essential amino acids, restored fertility without reducing the longer lifespans that are typical of dietary restriction, leading the researchers to determine that methionine acts in combination with one or more other EAAs to shorten lifespan. Restoring methionine to the diet of mice on a dietary restriction regimen blocks many acute benefits of dietary restriction, a process that may be mediated by increased production of hydrogen sulfide. Several studies showed that methionine restriction also inhibits aging-related disease processes in mice and inhibits colon carcinogenesis in rats. In humans, Methionine restriction through dietary modification could be achieved through a vegan diet. Veganism being a completely plant-based diet is typically very low in methionine, however certain nuts and legumes may provide higher levels. A 2009 study on rats showed methionine supplementation in the diet specifically increases mitochondrial ROS production and mitochondrial DNA oxidative damage in rat liver mitochondria offering a plausible mechanism for its hepatotoxicity. However, since methionine is an essential amino acid, it cannot be entirely removed from animals' diets without disease or death occurring over time. For example, rats fed a diet without methionine and choline developed steatopatitis, anemia, and lost two-thirds of their body weight over five weeks. Administration of methionine ameliorated the pathological consequences of methionine deprivation. Short-term removal of only methionine from the diet can reverse diet-induced obesity and promotes insulin sensitivity in mice. First, aspartic acid is converted via beta-aspartylsemialdehyde into homoserine by two reduction steps of the terminal carboxyl group. The intermediate aspartate semialdehyde is the branching point with the lysine biosynthetic pathway where it is instead condensed with pyruvate. Homoserine is the branching point with the threonine pathway, where instead it is isomerized after activating the terminal hydroxyl with phosphate, homoserine is then activated within phosphate, succinyl, or acetyl group on the hydroxyl, in plants and possibly in some bacteria phosphate is used. This step is shared with threonine biosynthesis, in most organisms, an acetyl group is used to activate the homoserine. This can be catalyzed in bacteria by an enzyme encoded by MET-X or META, in enterobacteria and a limited amount of other organisms, succinate is used. The enzyme that catalyses the reaction is META and the specificity for acetyl-CoA and succinyl-CoA is dictated by a single reside. The physiological basis for the preference of acetyl-CoA or succinyl-CoA is unknown, but such alternative routes are present in some other pathways. Cystathionine beta-synthase combines homocysteine and serine to produce cystathionine. Instead of degrading cystathionine via cystathionine beta-lyase, as in the biosynthetic pathway, Cystathionine is broken down to cysteine and alpha-ketobutyrate via cystathionine gamma lyase. The enzyme alpha-ketoacid dehydrogenase converts alpha-ketobutyrate to propionyl-CoA, which is metabolized to succinyl-CoA in a three-step process. Methionine might also be essential to reversing damaging methylation of glucocorticoid receptors caused by repeated stress exposures with implications for depression.
loss of methionine has been linked to senile graying of hair. Its lack leads to a buildup of hydrogen peroxide in hair follicles, a reduction in tyrosinase effectiveness, and a gradual loss of hair color. Methionine is an intermediate in the biosynthesis of cysteine, carnitine, taurine, lecithin, phosphatidylcholine, and other phospholipids. Improper conversion of methionine can lead to atherosclerosis. DL-methionine is sometimes given as a supplement to dogs, it helps to reduce the chances of stones in dogs. Methionine is also known to increase the urinary excretion of quinidine by acidifying the urine. Aminoglycoside antibiotics used to treat urinary tract infections work best in alkaline conditions, and urinary acidification from using methionine can reduce its effectiveness. If a dog is on a diet that acidifies the urine, methionine should not be used. Methionine is allowed as a supplement to organic poultry feed under the U.S. Certified Organic Program. Methionine can be used as a non-toxic pesticide option against giant swallowtail caterpillars, which are a serious pest to orange crops.